getting paid to think is a common communication within our company and um, that and and invest in yourself and uh, the way that technology is moving right now, it's it's incredible. You've got softwares like Canva now that essentially leapfrog needing to learn Photoshop. And I think everybody's fairly familiar with Canva. Um, even internally within our team right now, what used to be manual work where we would manually scrape a website to um, you know, find things like titles and meta descriptions and, and images. Well, now there's automated software to do that. Uh, you know, you even look at a grocery store now and you go to these self-service checkouts and these are being replaced. You know, Tesla's launching self-driving cars now and, you know, they're commenting on wanting to replace truck drivers. So there's sort of a twofold to the to this question. And really, as technology continues to move faster and faster, a lot of these very manual types of work are going to be automated or commoditized. You know, we look at Fiverr as an example and I know people that are graphic designers that are fantastic in the North American market, but because of globalization now in, in with the internet, there's somebody in in you know the Philippines or Serbia or or they could even be in Bali or Costa Rica right now where the cost of living is so much cheaper, and it's hard it's hard to compete. And uh, what we're finding more and more is that the technical skills are actually not as valuable versus this and the the strategic thinking, the creative thinking. Let's use let's use uh, Canva as an example. So we've got an employee on our, on our team that that is a graphic designer, and uh, or came in as a graphic designer. But I've been challenging him to become the creative director. And what do I mean by that? Uh, the the tasks that he's doing, the graphic design, the video editing, the thumbnail editing, etc. Being really transparent, it's actually not that valuable. But we transfer that to something like a Super Bowl billboard. If you took a Super Bowl billboard and copied it and pasted it and asked any graphic designer on Fiverr to copy it, anybody could get it done for $5. I think we can agree with that. But the strategy behind that advertisement is where the big money is, right? And people will pay a million dollars for that. You know, we're seeing photo ads right now on Facebook, just a very simple banner, right? We look at Black Friday or Cyber Monday or coming up to the Christmas holidays. One, one image can create a million dollars worth of revenue for somebody. But it's funny, the task is exactly the same, right? It's still just graphic design, it's picking colors. But the difference between a commoditized product and paid to think is that creative aspect. So really when I talk about getting paid to think, it's not the what you're doing, but the why you're doing it. And, and this type of skill set is essentially irreplaceable. I mean, we may come to a time five years, 10 years from now, where artificial intelligence or softwares can do that. But if you're constantly on the cutting edge of paid to think, that's where it really creates value. And then there's kind of the adage of, you know, a, a plumber shows up to your house and, you know, the hot water tank is leaking and your, your basement is flooding. And as that flood is happening, you're thinking of, oh my God, the insurance and everything is gonna get ruined. In your mind, it's thousands upon thousands upon thousands of dollars that's going to get resolved, right? Or get, sorry, it's going to get ruined. And this plumber comes in and fixes it with, in five minutes. Um, you're so thankful that it didn't ruin your whole basement. But really all he did is maybe take a wrench and turn one, you know, one screw or one, yeah, one screw. Uh, is it really turning the screw that the tactic of turning a screw? Well, anybody could do that. No, it's the ability to troubleshoot and actually identify the problem and solve that problem is what's what's really valuable. So this is kind of the analogy of paid to think. Um, I think far too often people are too stuck on the technical and tactical, which are important. You know, you need to be able to use Photoshop if you're gonna be a graphic designer. But the, the value of paid to think for the employees is that they get to level themselves up and be become more valuable. And then it gives them the ability to pitch me for more money or pitch clients for more money, which really means create more value. Um, the, the tactics are commoditized. The pay to think is, is completely abundant and, and, and hyper valuable, if that makes sense.